Okay, but like I said, I'm a class D celebrity. Okay. And by the way, most of the people who watch me hate me um, <laughs> because they're consumers. I mean, I get death. I get death wish, wishes all the time. The other day was, I hope you die of pancreatic cancer, you dinosaur. That's oddly, <laughs> that's oddly specific too. <laughs> exactly. 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 All right. So, should the consumer wait to buy a new or used car? The answer is no. They're being advised by people that don't know anything to wait. If you don't need to buy a car or a truck right now, new or used, wait. It's not going to get any better. The prices of new cars are going up. Will we be getting over MSRP like we are right now forever? Probably not, but for the foreseeable future we will. The vehicles are going to be more expensive anyway, and if they wait, they're not taking advantage of their trade-in opportunities because aren't they getting more Justin now for their trade-ins than they've ever gotten before? Way more. Way, way more. Used car prices aren't going down anytime soon. There is a scarcity of vehicles, period, end of sentence. You know what the average age of the vehicles on our highways right now is? 12.2 years, which is the oldest they've ever, ever, ever been. Um, and by the way, what do you think the prices of uh, autom automobile services, whether it be oil changes, uh, tire rotations, much less gasket or seal replacement, engine repairs, transmission repairs, what do you think the prices of those services have done? They all went up. They have all gone up. $80 oil changes. Uh, are routine yeah. now. Routine. So, people that, are, that want to wait to buy a new or used vehicle, they're going to pay more to maintain their existing vehicles. Their existing vehicles aren't going to depreciate as fast as they used to, but they will depreciate, I think. I don't think they can possibly appreciate two years in a row at 30%, yeah. but, but who knows? But, it now is a great time to buy a car or a truck because it's going to hold its value better than any vehicle they've ever purchased in their entire life. And, the, and people aren't used to that. I mean, you just, you just assume that you're buying a depreciating asset when you buy a new or, or, or used vehicle. That's just not the case anymore. Saudi is it? No, nowhere neither. No. Like I say, we're in, a, we're in a bizarro world here. All right, we need to adapt. All right. Yeah, 80 years of... Learning, you know, about uh, 80 years of uh, 80 years of, of, of understanding the cars and yeah. trucks depreciated. It isn't going to change easily. You know? No, no. It's ingrained in people. Yeah. All right, there.